Giga Chad, that dude is so bad, how the fuck he's so rad, he make me so mad, so strong, 12 inch dong, smashes girls like a gong, puff that chest King Kong, and women, drop they thong, keep it up, my life won't be too long, what the fuck I do wrong, this the fucking theme song, yeah. Giga Chad, that dude is so bad, how the fuck he's so rad, he make me so mad, so strong, 12 inch dong. Smashes girls like a gong, puff that chest King Kong And women, drop they thong Keep it up, my life won't be too long What the fuck I do wrong, this the fucking theme song Yeah Alright, what's up everybody, it's your boy Koi It's raining right now, but I've just got to jump into the cold water man I might get swept away, but it's an experience that I have to go through At least once in my lifetime it's eight o'clock in the morning, and this is my first ever cold plunge into the water. All right, let's go. That wasn't too bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. I'm ready again. Let's go. Fuck yeah, that was cold, but I did it bitches, I did it, I did it, just don't think about it man, just do it, the moment you start to doubt, the moment you start to question yourself, you're never gonna do it, you're never gonna get there man, just do it, just fucking do it, don't think about it, do what you need to do, stop being who you are, Stop being who you are. Stop being yourself, man. All these negative self-talks that you're not good enough, you ain't worth it. No one's gonna like you. Just, just cut it out, man, and just do it. Become who you need to be. Do what you need to do. Stop being yourself, man. Just stop, period, that's it. I'm gonna do it once more to prove your haters wrong. I don't need to do this, by the way. I don't need to do this. But I'm gonna do it anyway. I don't need to prove anyone wrong other than myself. That was a bit of an epic fail, but yeah, you get the idea. All right, boys. I hope you are doing extremely well out there. Any girls watching this? You can do it as well. You can do it. Stop being yourself. Just go out there and be who you need to be. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in all of you watching me. of that bullshit I'm back at home again and this is the real me talking to you guys that wasn't the real me to be honest with you guys I haven't been myself these past couple of days I've been posting videos every day for the past month and I feel like me you guys all of you watching me we have a relationship together we are in the same room we're speaking face to face as if we are in real life and I feel somewhat compelled to be vulnerable and be real with you all. I haven't been myself. I realize that I have placed a lot of 
significance and importance on my virginity and losing my virginity, I felt so disgusted. I felt so dirty. I felt so wrong to finally lose my virginity just like that. It, I feel like it loses its significance for something that I have held on for so long. I've just lost it like that to a girl whom I didn't even really care that much about. Well, I did to an extent care enough to share myself with her. <clears throat> but that wasn't the real me talking. That wasn't the real me whom I portrayed to her and yeah, that's not the real me, and that's why I felt so troubled with this whole situation. And I can't believe I let a situation, a single event, control myself, control my life. All day, every day, I keep thinking about her and thinking about how I used her, how she have used me how we both have used each other and yeah, I don't know what to say, man. It wasn't enjoyable. I guess the reason why it wasn't enjoyable was the fact that it wasn't authentic, it wasn't real. And I yearn for something real. I just had to cut it off right there and then with her yesterday. Yesterday night, I just told her, look, I can't do this to you anymore. I can't use you anymore. I don't see myself with you for the rest of my life and that's heartbreaking. Even though we might feel good in the moment, I know in the long term it's just going to lead to more heartbreak. And so I have to end it here with you. I cannot do it to you anymore. And that's what I did. I ended it. Now I know what it must have felt like for the girls in my life in the past to have rejected me. Maybe they saw no future together between us. I now know how hard it is for people to reject others. This isn't about being a nice guy or being an alpha or being red pill or black pill or whatever. This is being real. It's hard for people to reject others. It's so hard. And I no longer feel resentful towards the girls who rejected me in the past because I now know how hard it must have been. Maybe, just maybe, They were afraid of hurting me, so they came up with these bullshit lies. Oh, I'm not good enough for you. Oh, you can find someone better. No, bitch. It's hard for you to reject me because you're scared of hurting me. You're scared I'm, that I, I might do something. I'm a mentally unstable man. I might do something and I, I get it. Girls. You're vulnerable, you're, um, you're afraid of hurting me and I get that, I forgive you and I have to forgive myself also because I didn't understand this whole thing. Now I understand everything, well, not everything but I understand parts of it. Maybe you did like me some aspects of me but you couldn't see yourself with me long term and I respect that and I truly cherished every moment of our relationship I really do there are good parts good things good things about you all and I love that and I hope that you find someone out there for you eventually It hurts, man.
for both parties, not just the one who got rejected. I've been there, man. I've been rejected many times and I know it hurts. But I thought that the one who does the rejecting felt some sort of relief and joy in inflicting pain upon others. But that's not the case at all. I, I feel I feel such a visceral pain in my heart. Rejecting this girl, saying no to her. She's literally messaging me, asking me that she needed me to end her sexual urges. And I've never heard that before in my whole life. A girl telling me that she needs me. Bullshit, man. It's just bullshit. It's, it's hurting me as well. But I, I've just, I've just got to end it there, man. I just have to. It's never going to work. And yeah, it's, it's painful to me. But sometimes you just gotta, you just gotta experience and live. But yeah, for all of you watching, I thank you for sticking around and I hope you're doing extremely well. Stay strong, spread love. Spread love. Spread the love of God around to the people around you. <laughs> Be a good person. Be a nice guy. But this isn't about being a nice guy. Sometimes you just gotta do what you have to do. <laughs> Alright, God bless. I love you all and stay strong. And I'll see you next time in my next video. Peace.